Hey guys, as uh, another famous tuber sometimes says, what the hell did Jerome buy this week? I'm going to say, where the hell has Hitman been the last few weeks? I know I've been very sporadic, almost non-existent on the tubes. Um, just haven't been motivated to make a video, so I'm not going to make a video if I am not motivated to make a video. So um, I, I don't believe in just putting stuff out there just to, just to make something. So... Um, I am motivated to make a video tonight, so here I am. I just wanted to say hi to everybody. Hope everybody's doing great. Hope your collections are growing. And uh, that's it. So I just come here real quick tonight. I'm just doing a quick little uh, uh, review of some of the pickups I've made in the last few weeks, months or so. So not a lot of stuff. Um, I actually have been cutting back too on my purchasing. I just haven't been buying as much. So. Um, but yeah, let's let's go. Let's get into it. So the first couple of things um, I picked up, I got through. Um, where did I get these from? These I don't remember where I got these. Oh, I know where I got these. Never mind. It was a show this weekend, this past weekend, and in uh, in, um, in Fort Lauderdale. It's the uh, monthly show they have there at the Sawgrass um, Event Center in Plantation, Florida. And uh, it's Plantation, Florida, not Plantation, Florida. Uh, Plantation, Florida. And, uh, you know, it's a decent show. They have about 30 to 40 tables. And, you know, it's just, it's something to go to. It's, 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 um, it's, it's, it's great to have something like that. Um, and I picked up a few things um, out of... Uh, this guy's bins, a couple of Redskins cards. Um, I picked up this really nice uh, Art Monk. It's from uh, 2004 Panini Prism. And it's this really nice Prism Art Monk. Really shiny, really beautiful. Uh, and I've uh, pretty much now, in terms of football cards, I'm really not buying much football anymore. I'm only gonna stick to uh, Redskin stuff pretty much exclusively. Uh, I'm not buying product and putting sets anymore. I did yeah, a couple years. Uh, just not going to do that anymore. I'm going to just focus, really focus my football stuff on Redskins and maybe some Hall of Famers. That's that's all I'm doing. So picking this nice um, uh, Prime Signatures, uh, Joe Theismann. Um, this is out of 2000. Oh, God. I think it's 2016. That's a thick card. It's a thicky, as Ricky would say. It's a thicky, Ricky. So that's nice. And I got this nice other Joe Theismann. And this is out of Panini. Um, it's a decorated, uh, it's the NFL MVP, you know, commemorating his MVP in 83. And it's pretty cool. Um, Joe Theismann um, is letting, oh my God, I am so bad when it comes to names. Uh, whoever the Redskins drafted from Ohio State and my brain is completely blank. But Joe Theismann gave the blessing for him to win number seven because number seven was never retired by the Redskins. Uh, it's kind of been unofficially retired. So um, Dwayne, Dwayne, Dwayne Haskins, I believe. Yes, yeah, Dwayne Haskins. I'm pretty sure that's it. Um, they're, uh, they're number one pick this year. And he's going to wear number seven for the Redskins, which is, I think it's pretty cool. So... Um, so that's it for the Redskins stuff. I picked up one Don Manningly card. It's just a parallel. It's his uh, first home run card. I believe this is out of 15 tops. Um, it's the gold version. I didn't have the, I have the silver. I didn't have the gold. So I got that. And what else? I got a, a Mark Teixeira. This is a, out of Topps Holiday. It's just a, uh, a jersey card. I paid like four bucks for it. Figured what the heck. It's pretty cool. So I picked that up, and then I picked up this uh, SP, um, this SP variation from 2017 tops. It is a retired player. It's the Lou Gehrig. That goes right into the Yankee team set. So that's really nice, I like that. And then I uh, the rest of this stuff is all I believe. Oakland A's related stuff. Let me see here. It certainly is all Oakland A's related stuff, specifically 
after the first two cards, all Chris Davis. So I'm going to shout out all my Oakland A brothers out there. Uh, we got, um, who do we got? We got uh, Psyched on Baseball cards. We got Smitty. We got Oakland A's 915. We got Titanic Taters. Um, so yeah, all this stuff is Oakland A's. I've been on a complete Chris Davis bender lately. I've been picking up a lot of Chris Davis stuff. Sticking him in the binder, and um, there's actually more Chris Davis stuff that I have that I picked up that's in the binder that's not here, which I'll show off in one of my binder videos. Uh, but I picked up this uh, 86, how can you go wrong with an 86 Fleer Jose Canseco rookie? I think this was like two bucks, so I was like, yep, I'll take that. So I got that. I got a Max Muncy rookie. The 2015 tops. Max Muncy. I got a, I got a, Eclipse the light with my big old moon head. So it's not glaring on here. And then the rest is all Chris Davis stuff. Um, I've just been on such a Chris Davis bender. Um, the guy is just a great player. I know right now he's kind of like, he's not doing so much right now. Um, but he's put together three incredible seasons. And he's just got some awesome looking cards, man. His cards are just, I don't know. They're just very attractive looking cards. They really are eye appeal to him. A lot of eye appeal. So the first one I picked up is this 2018 Tops photo variation against the, uh, the the cage there. It's a batting cage photo. So that's really cool. And then I picked up another SP from 2018, and that is the New Era variation. He's got that old throwback A's hat from like the very early 70s. I think they wore those hats in like 69 and 70. Um, perhaps 71, but I know by 72, they had the yellow bills, but, uh, that's freaking awesome. Gotta love those Kelly Green A uniforms. And then I picked up this year's, uh, it's numbered 458 out of 999, the Chrome Refractor Chris Davis from Heritage. So now it's cool because I can now get this done, show it off, and put into the binder. <laughs> uh, these don't go in the binder because these are thickies. Um, I did the, uh, the Inception Rainbow. I don't know if there's any less of a, uh, there's a out of 50 here, but I don't know if they have a one of one. I, somebody let me know that. I, I have to look and see, but I got the base Inception. Just a, just a spectacular looking card. These cards look great, especially with the green of the A's uniform and just, just an awesome looking card. So that's his base. And then I got the, the green base, a par uh, parallel which is great because it's the color of the A's. And then I got the purple parallel number to 150. This is number 36 out of 150, which is really cool. Again, looks great. Just a great looking card. And then I got the pink numbered 14 out of 99 right there. And Last but certainly not least, I got the orange. And what's cool about this one, I numbered out of 50, it's a palindrome number. It's number five out of 50. So if you know what a palindrome is, a palindrome reads same forward and backwards. So it's zero five five zero. And if you read it backwards, it's zero five five zero. So just a little little bit there for your for your knowledge. So that is that. That is what I got. And, uh, geez, man, I hope to be back soon with another video. Um, I'm not going to promise anything, but who never knows with me. I kind of fly off the seat of my, or fly, fly by the seat of my pants, not fly off the seat of my pants. I'd be kind of be kinky, and I don't think we, we really want that. Um, I fly by the seat of my pants, and I just kind of do things when it comes up, and, uh, maybe sh shortly I will be back. Uh, but it's good to see everybody. Uh, hope. All is well with everybody, and I uh, hope to see you soon. And uh, just let me know uh, if there's any more Inceptions that I missed numbered-wise in terms of the parallels. That would be wonderful. I looked, and I couldn't see anything. I didn't see anything on eBay, but just uh, just let me know if there's something I missed. Maybe a one-of-one. -on -one, I'm not sure. Probably not going to get a one-of-one -on -one if it exists, but... Whatever. Um, so I'm going to I'm gonna go, guys. Uh, it's great, uh, great being back doing a video. I will catch you on the next time. And uh, like I always say, may the cardboard God shine upon each and every one of you all. Later.
Peace.